Welcome to A Farmstead Journey, where we dive deep into the realities of modern homesteading. Today, we're tackling a topic that many new chicken keepers overlook until they're knee-deep in feathers and bee bags, the economics of backyard chicken keeping. If this is a topic that interests you, go ahead and subscribe to my channel and join our growing community where you will have access to many more such informative and helpful videos. Now on with our discussion about chicken economics. Are chickens worth the cost and effort? Well, on the surface, it seems simple enough. Buy some chickens, give them a little food and water, and in return, they give you fresh eggs every morning. But as any experienced chicken keeper will tell you, there's a lot more to it. So let's break down the true costs and see if backyard chickens are really worth the investment. First, let's talk about the initial setup. If you're starting from scratch, you'll need a coop. And not just any coop. It needs to be predator-proof, well-ventilated, and large enough for the number of chickens you plan to keep. Depending on your budget and DIY skills, you're looking at anywhere from $200 for a simple DIY setup to over $1,000 for a pre-built, high-quality coop. Then there's the cost of the chickens themselves. Day-old chicks typically cost between $3 and $10 each, depending on the breed. But if you want older pullets, which are closer to laying age, you're looking at $15 to $30 per bird or more for rarer breeds. And let's not forget that if you're buying straight run chicks, roughly half of them could be roosters, which most urban and suburban areas don't allow due to noise ordinances. So there's the potential cost of rehoming or culling the roosters. Now on to the ongoing costs. Feed is the biggest recurring expense. A 50 pound bag of quality layer feed runs about $15 to $20, and depending on the size of your flock, you might go through a bag every few weeks. But chickens don't just eat feed, they also enjoy table scraps, garden greens, and the occasional bag of scratch grains or treats, which all add up. In addition to feed, chickens require bedding for their coop. Straw, wood shavings, or other bedding material costs about five to ten dollars a bale, and you'll need to change it regularly to keep your chickens healthy and your coop odor-free. Over a year, this can add another fifty to a hundred dollars to your cost. Healthcare is another expense that often catches new chicken keepers off guard. Chickens can suffer from a range of ailments, from mites and lice to respiratory issues and egg binding. Medications, supplements, or even a visit to a vet who specializes in poultry can quickly become costly. It's not uncommon for chicken owners to spend $50 to $100 annually on health care, even for a small flock. Let's not forget about the hidden costs, the value of your time. Chickens require daily care, including feeding, watering, cleaning the coop, collecting eggs, and keeping an eye on their overall health. It's a labor of love, but it's labor nonetheless. If you value your time at even minimum wage, those hours add up quickly. But let's get to the main question. Are you actually saving money on eggs? Let's do some quick math. Say you have a flock of six hens and each lays about five eggs a week. That's roughly 30 eggs a week or about two and a half dozen. Over the course of a year, that's around 130 eggs. If you're spending $400 to $500 annually on feed, bedding, and health care, you're paying roughly three to four dollars per dozen eggs. Factor in the initial setup cost and that price per dozen goes up significantly for the first year. Compare that to the cost of eggs at the grocery store. Even for organic free range eggs, you might be paying five to six dollars a dozen. So while you might not be saving much, if anything, in terms of money, what you are getting is the assurance of knowing exactly where your eggs come from, the satisfaction of caring for your own animals, 
and often a superior taste and freshness. And as many chicken keepers will be happy to tell you, chickens also contribute to our mental health by fostering relaxation, providing companionship, and encouraging outdoor activities, making them wonderful additions to their lives, regardless of cost. So are backyard chickens worth it? Economically, probably not. But for many, the value isn't in the savings, it's in the experience, the connection to your food, the joy of watching your hens roam the yard, and the pride of collecting fresh eggs each morning. If that's worth more to you than the dollar signs, then backyard chickens are definitely worth the investment. Thanks for tuning in to A Farmstead Journey. I hope today's video has given you some food for thought. If you've got any questions or want to share your own experiences with chicken keeping, drop a line in the comments section. Also, I would be thrilled if you would join my online community by subscribing to my channel. Happy chicken keeping! And once again, thanks so much for watching.